In Bangladesh, at least 130 people have been killed in violent clashes during student protests against a controversial quota system for government jobs. The crisis escalated when the appellate division of the Supreme Court overturned a high court order that had led to the protest. The new ruling reserves 93% of government jobs for merit-based candidates, with just 5% allocated to freedom fighters and their descendants, and 1% each for tribes differently abled individuals and sexual minorities. Simultaneously, authorities in the United Arab Emirates have launched an investigation and expedited trial for Bangladeshi nationals' arrest for protesting against their home government across the Gulf country. The UAE's attorney general's office has indicated these individuals on charges included gathering in a public place and protesting against their home government with the intent to incite unrest as well as the obstructing law enforcement causing harm and damaging property. The state-owned Emirates news agencies reported that the public prosecution has ordered petrial detention for the accused pending further investigations. The UAE protest followed weeks of demonstrations in Bangladesh where protesters were challenging a quota system that reserved up to 30% of government jobs for relatives of veterans from the 1971 war of independence. The recent partial rollback of the system by Bangladesh top court has been seen as a victory for the student protesters. Political parties and labor unions are banned in UAE where broad laws severely restrict freedom of speech and most major local media are state-owned or state-affiliated.